Are you looking for the best coucherie boards? My mother-in-law got this one for my wife. I wanted to do a little unboxing of it for you today and show you guys what you all get with this particular board here. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that we like, use, and have, and my mother-in-law buys for my wife. <laughs> so if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button and hit the bell too. That way you actually get notified of our videos. So what we have here, it's a bamboo one. It's a, it's a kushari board is like a meat board, meat and cheese type of board. This is a bamboo cheese board set here. This is the one that we found on Amazon. The features that they claim are on there, there's about seven here. Let me go through them real quick. The entire wood serving tray is made of 100% natural bamboo, which is BPA free. So it's definitely safe for you and your family members. Durable material, not long, only for longer time use, but also antibacterial and antimicrobial. Uh, bamboo is known for its bacteria resistance. Elegant texture surface and warm and natural bamboo color to add to your kitchen decor. We, okay, this is what sold me on this one. You get Four, a set, four set of cheese knives, which are made high quality stainless steel and bamboo handles, are easy to grip for use and bring smooth uh, touching feel. I really like that they included the knives in there. Uh, the clever design of a removable stand cheese knives block definitely holds your knives organized and display their true beauty. I thought that was cool too. They have like a little stand for it as well. This little doohickey right there. Uh, the bamboo cheese board features a special long groove which is hold crackers and toast and fresh. So there's a groove in there. It's a standard size 11 inch by 13 inch and about it says 0.7 inches high which is a little over half an inch. Provide you with enough spaces to serve your delectable cheeses, meats, fruit, crackers, and appetizers. And it's a practical gift for all these different occasions. So this is it right here. It comes nice and shrink wrapped in there. Let me see if there's anything else in there. Nope. Um, everything's all nice and shrink wrapped. So it's a nice big bamboo block. If you wanted to, honestly, just looking at this at first glance, you could easily flip this thing over and use it as a cutting board on the back if you wanted to. So it almost has a dual purpose there. And then you have your, let me open this thing up so we can get into this. I want to take a look at this. It does come with one of these silica packs in there. We don't need that. And it's made by this company called Hose. Hosejoy? Hose, I don't know how to say that. Hosejoy? Hosejoy? Hosea Joy? Do y'all know how to say that? Let me know down in the comments below. Um, saran wrap. So this mm -hmm, smells a little like a bamboo. This is maybe like a, I can't smell it. Like a natural wood smell to it. It actually smells quite nice. You can tell that there's two little holes right there. That's where our knives are going to hold. And then you have, this is the groove that they were talking about right there for you to be able to put your uh, display of crackers and all that type of stuff on there. And then this right here is like a little serving spot where you can put a dish to put some, uh, some like dips and whatnot. Uh, so that's perfect there. Let's go ahead and open up these knives right here. This is a solid piece of bamboo right there. I really like it. Let's see, let me get my, my Mike Vance knife out. Got this, uh, call this the Mike Vance because it's uh, a knife that a guy named Mike Vance, one of you, one of you guys, uh, sent to me to my P.O. box, which uh, I'll link up down in the description below if you guys ever want to send me anything. But this, see, it's got two little, like little dowel bottoms right there, and that fits into those holes right there. And then now you have a nice place to put your, uh, your knives for whenever you're, it's cheese time. So you got your cheese all out there. You can take this, chop, 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 do whatever you do. Chop, chop, chop right there. And they go right back into here, right in their place. Everything has a spot. That's what I teach our kids. Everything has a safe spot. So if you put everything in the safe spot, you will never be able to lose them. And so this is just a perfect little platter for displaying something, maybe for a, a special occasion, a holiday, a birthday, something like that, if you're into meat and cheeses. We've been eating a lot of different kinds of cheeses lately, and so um, it's been fun to test it out. Now we will have a nice little platter that we can put everything out on. My wife, my, my mother-in-law actually came down, she lives in Oklahoma, she came down and visited us, and uh, my wife was just kind of casually talking, and she remembered her saying, oh, a cheese board or some kind of coucherie board would be really nice to be able to put all these fancy cheeses that we've been buying on. So uh, this is gonna be perfect. Perfect. I'm very excited to, to see what she's going to think of it whenever she gets it as a gift. 
Um, and I also like how this thing can come out. It just makes washing a little bit easier whenever you need to go and wash it. You can kind of get underneath there and whatnot. And if you wanted to wash um, the insides of the knives too, because I'm sure inside this little sleeve right here, it's gonna get a little dirty and gunky down there. So you can kind of take this out and give it a good wash off and whatnot. Also, they mentioned the bamboo handles on there too. I actually like the, the look of these bamboo handles right there. They seem very nice, easy to grasp, got a nice big nub on there. So you can actually get a good chop from there. Uh, all in all, nice bamboo set really like it if you guys want to check this out like i said i'll link it up down in the description below y'all can go read other people's reviews about it don't just take my word for it i'm just one guy literally checking it out for the first time because my wife wanted one of these so if you guys want to check it out again linked up down in the description below otherwise if you guys want to see we have the coolest uh kitchen blender i'm gonna put it right there on the screen it's called the ninja blender if you guys don't have one of these you have to get one it's like a blender food processor like mixer upper chopper thing all in one go check that bad you guys got to go watch that video i'll see y'all in that video thank you dads for watching that thumbs up is always appreciated and dad out what's your favorite kind of cheese let me know that in the comments